Hi, this is Gregory Giannakova. I want to talk to you about white label. Now, white label is when you, sort of like a business in a box, they call it sometime. And that is where someone else has built the entire infrastructure and they might be calling it, you know, ABC Telecom. But they'll make a deal with you. Sometimes they'll charge you up front a little bit or sometimes, sometimes not. Our company doesn't charge up front, I think maybe $99, it's almost nothing. And they customize the front end so that it looks like what I'm dealing with you is XYZ Telecom. You're actually dealing with ABC Telecom, but all I see is XYZ and I go, wow, this is amazing. Look at this guy, Dave. You've got this beautiful system. But really, Dave just got it from the other guys and he just spent $99 and reskinned it. Now, how does that even work? You wonder, how can someone present it to Dave and then Dave sell it to me still at an attractive price? It's because the someone, the XY, the ABC company, buys in big bulk and they buy a lot of volume and they've got engineers and they've got programmers and they set this whole system up and they sell it to Dave. It doesn't really cost anything. They set up a different skin, a different color, put his logo up and everything. And whenever I then buy from Dave at XYZ company, when I click on something, it actually just goes to ABC company and gets inside their engine and delivers the product and service to me. I'm thinking um, one, one very good example is this is a company that I'm involved in, and they sell telephone numbers. So telephone numbers and setting up those services and making those, those deals, it, it takes a lot. I mean, a telephone company, a larger company, a well-known you know, national or global company like uh, say British Telecom, for example, when you want to set up a deal with British Telecom, it actually takes, uh, they want to know you're going to do $25,000 a month with them. So, you know, you and I can't do that. Dave can't do that. I can't do that. But the telecom ABC company could do that. When I was ABC, that's actually what we did. We made these great big expensive deals knowing that other people can't make those. So then we're going to buy something for a penny and we're going to sell it for three cents. And then to Dave, Dave can sell it to me for five cents or six cents. And then I can sell for 10 cents, roughly speaking. So that's how, that's how that works. So, you know, really, it's actually quite interesting that how many businesses you could start. I mean, you, you, you should only start one business, but how many different kinds of businesses you can start by looking for white label opportunities. For example, if you wanted to be in the telecom business and sell SMS messaging, MMS messaging, uh, telephone numbers, forwarding numbers, and start your own telecom company, I know of a number of companies you can do that with. One of, one of them's our company. You pay like $99 and you get a you know, half a million dollars worth of, of back end already for you. Um, there's other companies that sell PBX, what we call PBX, but telephone systems for businesses. So why would you have to spend $89,000 or $100,000 setting up a business, setting up the servers, hiring technicians, hiring engineers? You don't have to do that. You can pay about $1,000 and sometimes a lot less to get access to someone else who's already set that up. They've already tested all the equipment. They can actually almost give you an operating manual on what to do and you go out and sell. So with this white label business is really good for if you're on the on the buying side, if you're on if you're Dave or you're me, but if you're Dave, is that if you're good at marketing, if you like selling and marketing and you're good at that, or you have a good in to some to some vertical market, then going white label is a really good solution because you don't have to invest hardly anything and you get the half a million or a million dollar platform behind you, and then you can go ahead and sell. So let's say you uh, had it in with car dealers and um, you could sell, you like selling. So you could sell telephone systems to car dealers. You could sell telephone numbers to answering services or doctors. Um, anything that's a vertical, you can get the whole platform. You know, Dave gets the whole platform from ABC company for a small amount of investment. Then he just goes out and sells like crazy. And the platform company does most of the customer support, which is really expensive to build up. So think about what you'd like to do. Is it social media marketing? Is it telecom? Is it telephone systems? Um, there's there's a, a whole plethora of, of uh, white label out there. In fact, if you type in uh, whatever you'd like to do, let's say security cameras, you type in white label security cameras, you can Google that, and you're going to find a number of companies that have the entire system, the servicing, the um, 24-7 alarm answering and all that other stuff, they have that already and what they're really looking for is to make more sales. So they'll give you the product at 50% off and you can sell it for normal retail. You do the selling, they'll do the support, they'll ship the cameras out. You can do this for cameras, for telecom, you can do it for a, a number of businesses. So if you like selling and you don't want to invest a million dollars, white label might be for you. Take a look at it. Yeah, take a look at it. You'll find some really interesting opportunities out there. If you need some ideas or you need some leads, hit me up. I'll try to help you out. Thanks. 
you know, Weight Label is kind of like a franchise in a way when you think about it. You don't have to do all the work and thinking and proving. Franchises cost a lot of money, anywhere from you know, $10,000 to millions of dollars, a million dollars. But on a Weight Label, you're kind of getting the same thing, but without the brand name, and you build your own brand name. And that's where the, let me just add this, that's where the profit is, building your own brand name. You can do network marketing, you can sell for other people and whatever, whatever. You never really build any equity because you don't have a brand name. But if you take on a white label, put your name on everything and then you do the selling, now you're building up your brand and after a while you have a thousand customers buying phone service from you and you can take those customers and either you know, enjoy the profit from it or you can take those customers and sell them to somebody else in the business. I've seen that a lot. It's kind of like a franchise but it doesn't cost very much. You need any help figuring this out? You want some ideas? Hit me up.